Hey freaky people, it's super freaky one are you. Um, I'm going to do a sample box wars video. This one is going to be about my new beauty test tube from the spring. I didn't have time to do it when I got it. And they are back on sale again on QVC, both the single sale and the auto delivery. So I thought I would do the video now and throw it up there with like the with the link as always so that you guys can get it. Because I know a lot of you uh, missed it last time and I don't know if you've gotten it yet. So I love QVC new beauty test tube. I get asked like 10 times a day what are like my top five sample boxes and I'm going to be doing a video on that as soon as I actually get I'm I'm testing a bunch of new boxes like this month and uh so you know I've, I've got glossy box and crave box and there are a couple other boxes too um but anyhow uh QVC test tube I will have I will not cancel this one ever love it so if that's any indication for you, it's it'll it's gonna be in the top five somewhere. Love it uh, because I love QVC and it has QVC products in it. So there you go. Anyhow, uh, in this test tube, uh, and comes with a magazine every time. It's a ten dollar magazine, so you know that's a third of the price of the box. For anyone who doesn't know, twenty about thirty dollars for the box. And then you pay eight for shipping. So it's about $38. Comes out every four months. So uh, every three months. So four times a year. So you got like a winter, spring, summer, fall new beauty test tube. And each one has products tailored to that uh, season. So anyhow, they all come with the magazine. Magazine's $10. Usually I, you know, page through them. Don't really do much for me. They are have very expensive products and procedures that don't you know I can't afford this one does have like a $1,500 perfume and a $34 eyelash curler from Chanel but <laughs> I actually like this one it has it's the extreme anti-aging issue and it's the or the, well it has extreme anti-aging articles and it's the makeover issue and it does like makeover Make over your smile, make over your hair, make over your skincare, make over your makeup, you know, make over lots of stuff. And it actually has very useful information on it, like uh, it has hair makeovers, like best cuts to get. It has a whole section here that I love about uh, chemical peels and uh, like what the light ones are, the mediums up ones are, the best ones for at home. And uh, it's, I just, I just really like this one. So, yeah. There you go. I'm actually going to keep it and read it. Okay, first thing that came in the test tube was the Strivectin SD. And this is the new intensive concentrate for stretch marks and wrinkles. This actually came in a sample society box. Uh, but I haven't hauled it yet. And it's actually not the same, the sample. I mean, it's the same product, but I'll explain it later in the other video. But here's what it is. And this one, it has four times the amount uh, of collagen boosting ingredients that the previous version of Strivectin had. So if you've tried Strivectin in the past and you didn't think it worked well on you, you might want to give it a try again because it's got four times the power. It also has niacin in it, which is, if anyone, you know, if anyone has noticed, niacin is like a hot, hot commodity these days for skincare. It's showing up in a lot of uh, brands. In fact, there's like the, the, what, the Nia what I, I forget the number after it, but uh, that skincare stuff. I mean, they have the everybody's using niacin in it, and uh, that's because it really, really works <laughs> on your skin. And it's something that they have recently found out. And uh, it says it's a micronutrient found in many foods, but the recent emergence of niacin in topical form has proven to be a valuable tool against fighting for aging, fighting against aging, so yay. But anyhow, this has two to eight weeks. You're gonna see results in eight weeks. Actually, in two weeks, your collagen production will have started like resurging, 
At week four, cell turnover is intensifying. And by week eight, wrinkles and stretch marks are visibly diminished. So there's that. There you go. I think that's a nice one. I'm going to try it. I have tried Strivectin in the past. But actually not Strivectin, like the, the Walgreens version, you know, like Walvectin or <laughs> whatever. But it was like an under eye circle one and it didn't worry at all. Uh, anyhow, next thing in the box is from Wen and it is the cleansing shampoo. This time I got Sweet Almond Mint and I meant cleansing conditioner when I said cleansing shampoo. <laughs> and uh, I did learn something about Wen. Uh, first it's new spelled backwards because it's a new way to wash your hair. I didn't know that. Well, I mean, I knew that W-E-N is N-E-W backwards. I'm not, not dumb, but I didn't know that's why I named it when. Um, but <laughs> each scent has a different uh, purpose, which I didn't know. I just thought you picked the scent that you like the most, and then that's what you used. But apparently, uh, find a medium hair sweet it's that's what sweet almond mint is for fine and medium hair and it moisturizes or it hydrates and replenishes uh the lavender scented one it moisturizes dry dehydrated or wavy to curly hair which is what i actually have but i'd I'm not big on lavender lately it's been bugging me so i'm actually glad to not get that one and cucumber aloe is perfect for fine for dry, fine to medium textured hair with oily scalps. So it does not say anything in here about thick hair, so I guess you're all SOL. I don't know. <laughs> I'm sure there's another one. All the scents aren't coming in here, just the ones that went out in this box. So I loved the one I got before was Vanilla Mint. Uh, it smelled like mint chocolate chip ice cream. This one actually just smells minty. It doesn't smell nearly as good to me, which is sad. I love one, but I don't use it very often because I love it, and so I hoard it. It's, it's, I don't know, it's what I do. Like, if I have a soap I really love, then I'll cut it into tiny chunks and use it, you know, whatever. <laughs> Next thing in the box, oh, I love this stuff so much, is Peter Thomas Roth. Focus. and is the laser-free regenerator moisturizing gel cream. I have just recently stopped testing skincare for 3Lab. Loved the stuff I used. I think my face has been looking great. And so I have the full sizes here. I'm gonna be doing the review for you soon. But for like the last like week and a half to two weeks, I've been incorporating other products. Uh, because I didn't, I ran out of product, and so I've been waiting for the full sizes to come. And I actually didn't run out of eye cream. I've been putting the eye cream that I have left over on everything because <laughs> I didn't want to lose the benefits that it had given me. But anyhow, I don't know why I just smell this. It doesn't smell. Uh, I have used. Look how much I've used of this. I've used a ton. I love this stuff. It is like a just a pale pink. Uh, it's a gel cream. I must just really, I'm putting it somewhere because I'm not wasting it. I must really just love gel cream formulas because the three lab products I love are all gel cream too. Um, this, people, uh, somebody had posted on my QVC board that I hang out at all the time that uh, why, why do people, whenever they use, Peter Thomas Roth stuff they say I saw the difference after one use and they're like that's so crap you can't see a difference after one use but you can I saw the difference after one use and it's not just me there are a ton of people that like started another thread saying I did I did I did this stuff is amazing is amazing I love it and that is very scary because I am already hooked on expensive skincare and now I'm here I am adding more love to the Oh, it's so good though. The red is from Dragon's Blood and it like hydrates your skin and it calms like overexposed uh, complexions, which, you know, I, I'm like sunburned now. I go out in the sun, I like turn bright red, I get windburned. I get, I mean, it's like crazy. Just outdoors does not like me. And so uh, 
this is like the perfect product for me. I just, I love it. I can't say enough about it. Love it, love it, love it. So, okay, I'll shut up now. Next thing in the uh, box, I, dang it, I forgot to say what the amounts were. I'll say it at the end. Okay, <laughs> next thing in the box is from Bliss. It is the Fabulous Filming Face Wash. It's a two-in-one cleanser and exfoliator. And I'm gonna come in real tight and show you, see if you can see. There is like those little bubbly things in there. Those are like beads, uh, like little soft plasticky type. I don't think they're plastic. It just says soft round beads. I don't know. They could be anything. Tapioca. I don't know. But they have these little itty bitty soft round beads in there uh, that exfoliate. Now, I just got done saying how sensitive my skin is. I burnt my entire scalp getting my hair colored. I used Olay Pro X and burnt my entire face for a month. I have sensitive skin and I have to be very careful with what products I exfoliate with. This is very gentle. It is too gentle. I mean, I, I was like, what? It's not doing anything. I like wash my face with that and then I feel like I have to go exfoliate. So it's not bad. It's just not gonna give you a really good exfoliation. But as a face wash like and makeup remover and stuff like that, it's okay. So uh, next is the Philosophy Amazing Grace. And it is perfumed shampoo, bath, and shower gel. It's a three-in-one. And like every other philosophy product of this type that we've had in the box before, this one as well has like a luminescence to it. It is very pretty. And I use them as shampoos. Um, I normally use shampoo bars, uh, but when I'm testing out stuff, uh, I'll use regular shampoo or whatever for samples uh, but when I want like a true like luxury hair washing experience if I'm like doing like a, a you know with a bath bomb and a body bar and you know I'm going to exfoliate and I'm going to do like I want like a spa experience this is what I wash my hair with is maybe not this scent which I do love because this is the scent in this is Amazing Grace it's their best selling perfume and I really like it uh, but I don't know that I wear it as a perfume though, but I like it as a shampoo. But all of them, they just smell wonderful and they lather beautifully and I just think it makes like your shower bath time more exciting. <laughs> but not a dirty way. Okay, next in the box is from Saint Tropez and it is the Everyday Body Moisturizer Gradual Tan in Medium to Dark. Now, I did get this sample in that Allure Beauty Box. and No, in the Sephora uh, Summer Box. And I said then that, you know, I was probably going to give it away because it said medium dark. Well, I've actually read up on it a little. And it is a gradual one, so I can always stop. And then supposedly this this moisturizer uh, no matter how many times you go over like a patch of skin with it it won't get you darker than if you like if I put this hand and I put like one pass of like a moisturizer and then this hand I just like rubbed for like five minutes with more product they're both gonna tan the exact same amount they said that the only thing that doesn't that doesn't tan is if where you don't put it and so no matter how much you put on it always you get tanned at the same rate, but if you don't put it on, like they said, don't forget in between your fingers, in between your toes, you know, back of your knees, or well, I don't know about back, it doesn't say that, but I'm assuming, you know, but or like an elbow, can you imagine? <laughs> like, oh, my elbows are dry, I gotta like treat them, okay, but anyhow, yeah, so I think I'm gonna try this one. If I don't like it, then I can give the other one away because and it, oh, it has like a thing in there that. Uh, it takes away the nasty self tanner smell so I and I can't stand that smell so I'm going to try it I decided okay two more things in the box first is from Tarte and it is a lip surgeon's lip luster and they came in either adored frisky or fever I got frisky and that's the color you can see it's like 
really close, you know? So that's when, if you buy these, the color that it is is the color you're going to get. And that I like about the Tarte. And if your packaging has like little itty bitty shimmers in it, then it is a luster. And if it's just plain colored, then it is a lip tint. So um, that's easy way to tell. I did not have this color, so I was like, woo, you know, because I love these. Um, but I was really happy to have it. These are the other three or the other two colors that you could have gotten. Uh, this, the middle one is the one I got. So there's like a more red one. <laughs> there's a light pink one and a more red one. One of these days I'm gonna figure out that that's backwards. I swear to God I will. Okay, last thing in the box is from Mally and it is an Ever Color Shadow Stick. And I believe everyone got it in Twilight. Now this is what they look like, okay? It's like, Twilight is like a gold, goldish color. And I love these. Now, I have a Twilight. I hate it. And I don't know if I got a bum Twilight and I need to open this new one. Or if I, they're all like that and then I could just give it away or use it as a giveaway for the, for my channel or whatnot. But here, this is what happens on my Twilight. So... It goes in two colors. See, the middle, the middle of my stick, please focus, is like a darker color. So it always looks like that when you put it on. And so then I have to blend it together. And when I blend the colors together, that one dried it too fast then I think it looks muddy. It doesn't have like their glowiness to it. I don't know. Uh, if you have this, tell me if I got a bum one. And that way I can be sure. Because look, I mean, I have other shadow sticks. And I mean, I just grabbed like a couple of them. None of them do that. They're all perfect. So I don't know if I just got a bum one or if it's just that color, so I don't know. But Mally Shadow Sticks as a whole are absolutely fantastic. Like, I just put those on, okay? And, uh, well, it wiped off because, <laughs> but if I had given it another 30 seconds, it wouldn't have, I promise you. Okay, here, look, here's the ones that I don't like. They don't, they stay, they stay, they stay for like the day. That's why I like them and why I have so many in colors. I just don't know if mine's bum or if I just don't like that color. So that's everything in the box. Uh, if you have any questions about anything, let me know. Um, I will put a link below to the auto delivery. If you don't want auto delivery, there'll be like a little thing on here on the top of the screen. Not on my screen, on the QVC. <laughs> and then you'll be able to... Uh, then you'll be able to click onto that to get to that uh, but so I will put that link below and um, yeah I usually say see you freaky people but uh, peace love and samples <laughs> bye